Today we're dipping our toes into the world of malware sandboxing and analysis. If you've ever felt stuck staring at a suspicious file or URL, unsure if you're under attack, you're going to love our malware reports tool. We made this because our team was tired of the fragmented data that was being provided by conventional tools, so we did something about it. We created Group IB's Malware Reports Library. It's a free tool, no sign up required, and it makes it much easier to understand what that suspicious file might be doing on your endpoints. We're going to look at five practical ways that you can integrate the Malware Reports tool into your daily workflow. First up, search. Here's a familiar scenario. You've been handed a hash with zero context. Paste it into Malware Reports and suddenly you're looking at the full narrative. Maybe it's part of a phishing campaign targeting financial institutions or tied to domains spoofing major retailers. Even if a specific file isn't in the database, you can search by similar cases, by shared resources or secondary files that it creates. This is attribution in action. Behavior. Suppose your antivirus flags a file as suspicious or malicious. Beyond the initial attribution, you need to know what it does. Does it drop hidden executables? Does it modify system files? Does it communicate with command and control servers? Here you can see how Malware Reports reveals how deeply ransomware like Lockbit embeds itself. You can see things like registry modifications and secondary files making it clear that simply deleting the original file isn't enough. And armed with this intel, you can isolate and clean compromised hosts confidently. Signatures. Insights are only useful if they lead to action. Let's say you read about a new malware strain targeting your industry. By searching for it in Malware Reports, you can see its signatures and behaviors and then create detection rules like Sigma or Yara for your systems. This is intelligence-led security helping you anticipate and block threats before they strike. Evolution. We all know that malware evolves, but so should your defenses. Malware Reports lets you compare behavior across samples from the same family. For example, newer variants of a threat might shift from HTTP to DNS tunneling for communication. Identifying these patterns helps you refine detection rules and stay one step ahead of the enemy. Lastly, learning. Malware Reports is an awesome learning resource. Junior analysts can validate their findings against detailed reports, sharpen their reverse engineering skills, and it's also a great tool for team collaboration because sharing these reports across teams raises awareness and expertise across the board. That is an overview of Malware Reports.